In this tutorial, I will show you how to import email list to System.io. Hi and welcome to this channel. If this is your first time, you are welcome. But let's get straight into the video. First, we're going to hover over contact and click on contacts. My contact is still loading because I have a poor internet service, but I don't need to wait because what I have to do next is to click on import contacts. Please pay attention to this message. You are about to import new contact into your account. Be aware that you should only import contact who give you their permission to send them emails and this is very important please don't import email lists from solo ads like in ads that you bought from solo ad companies that means the people on it they've not given you the authority to email them and guess what your emails will end up in the spam or they will unsubscribe and which is not good for your domain and when that happens a high percentage of your complaints will get your account blocked you don't want that with that established let's move on we're gonna scroll down right here click on choose file all right choose csv file with contacts that means your file that you're gonna be importing should be compressed to csv that's the only way it's gonna work you can drag and drop or click on choose file this is my file i'll click on it click on open i'll go with the drag and drop option and i'll show you the reason why i'm gonna open my folder this is the file but i cannot upload this i'm gonna open it and this is what i want i'll drag and drop this one so let me show you drag so drag because i'm recording this is giving me problems what i'll do i'll right click and copy and i'll go to i'll go to desktop right click and paste it here this is it and now i'll go back and i'll choose file it's good i'm showing you this because in case you run into problems click on choose and go to desktop this is it because this one is compressed this will work click on it and click open this is it then keep the camera like this let it be the way it is don't change anything because the comma works better compared to the semicolon and the pipe all right i have to choose the tag that i would like these emails to go to just in future if i have to promote any product i know the group they belong to and if that particular product fits their need if you for instance i will import it into one of these you just have to click on it or you can import into two but remember if you import into more tags it's going to increase your contact limit that you have depending on how much you have in case i have five thousand if you are on the free plan you might have two thousand let's say if this file has 20 contacts and now I have checked two it might increase to 40 because from the experience i have from aweber that's how it works but it's up to you this might be different who knows but i don't want to take chances but in this particular tutorial i'll create a new one because this list is different from this because the needs for this contact is different from these contacts i have here i'll create new all right click on create and I'll name it I will name it profitable online business and I will click save as soon as I save it it's checked already and that's cool but later if you change your mind and you want to add more tags that's up to you you can just check it but in this tutorial I want just one optional if you want to add the contact to an existing email campaign I have set up email campaign already now the thing is do I want to add this tag to this campaign I have but I don't want to add to it I'll not add it I'll leave it that's why it says optional next your emails will pop up here that means it's right but like i said earlier on if you click on if you import the folder this will not show that means it's wrong make sure you don't import the folder you just have to import the file please choose the data type of each column i'll click here and let me see what we have we have this depending on how i set it up before i captured the emails let's see i didn't include names i'll just keep it as email i have over 20 contacts on this list but this is the only contact Contact it's gonna show but later on don't worry when you import everything will display next click on import importing contact this might take a few minutes says approved today this is today's date and the time that i initiated this the progress is zero out of 42 invalid data no invalid rows status approved i'm gonna wait when everything is done i'll give you update so this is the date i set the email list from where i imported this from i had over hundreds of emails 
but some of them i deleted them some unsubscribe and i kept these serious people these are the good ones all right guys i've run into a major problem trying to import my email contact or my contact list after an hour i tried again everything is bad it's not importing the files or the contact the problem is this thing is set up see important please make sure the first row contains the name of each column this is a major problem all right guys so the next day i woke up and i'm like let me just check it to see what's going on and see what i can do to solve this problem so when i checked it worked which is good to be sure i have to go to my tags to make sure i have this in there so let me show you quick so contact tags and guess what this is it and this was done yesterday so that means it didn't take 24 hours but it happened yesterday around the time i gave up on this thing all right so this is it so i have all my contacts here and this will be the next page okay and the following page so i have everything in here good if you have created your landing page or your opt-in page already i'll show you how to add the first name on it all right when i'm capturing my emails or when i set up my funnels i don't include names because it has a low conversion rate i try to avoid that now moving forward i'll include first name before the email address and this is the reason in future if i want to move my contact list to another website builder i will not run into this same problem to avoid that the best way to do that is let's say you can click i'll click inside and as you can tell i have this element because if i click outside the element will go i will click inside and you have to scroll down and form form input drag it and drop it on top of the email and warning input type not set i'm gonna hover and click on the setting sign and input type select type select first name as input type and the placeholder i can change this let's say first name instead of the small n i can change it to caps this is how it works and instead of i can change this to 16 and what else or you can go back to 18 but it looks like i have let me check this i have a different font altogether font size is 24 for this so reduce it to 18 yeah this is good sorry this i'll keep it like this and i'll save first i'm gonna keep it like this let me try this when i and on mobile everything is showing which is good save and go back save again now i'm gonna exit and i'll try this it's right here let's say if i try here all right i try to click both and it's prompting me to fill the form that means if i don't enter my first name and the email address i cannot proceed which is good all right i'll go back to my other funnel and i have changed this one too oh yeah this i don't have that one too edit scroll down hover no go to pop up view pop up see i don't have here too all this in future if i have to move on or import to a different email marketing network it's gonna cause a problem i'll drag this sorry. i'll drag this and drop it on top then click on this the settings select type first name save let me see if the font size 18 18 but i will just work on this email address i'll keep it like this save i'll exit and i'll go view and let me try it bam first name and address let me just change this one pop up the secure click on this i like to start my stuff with apps so go back undo or refresh bam moving forward when i create my opt-in form i will include first name because i realize it's really important in future if i have to port my contacts because this the money is in the list make no mistake this is the end of the tutorial thanks for your time please don't forget to like comment and subscribe to this channel